My father is dead. Charles Lee now leads the Templar Order in his place. I see now why ours is an eternal war. For each piece taken from the board, another is placed upon it. Back and forth we go. Across the world. Across the ages. Some days mine feels an impossible task. But I cannot afford to be consumed with doubt. People need me. Now more than ever. I must stop the Templars. I will kill Charles Lee. today to remember a man of fearless vision who sought to change the world and change the world he did look around even now the british prepare to retreat their spirits broken their forces splintered the patriot leadership shall soon fall either into our service or into the ground and then my friends all of this will finally be ours. We have Hatham to thank for this. He and all those others who sacrificed for our cause. But he was not content merely to save the people of America, no. He sought to save those sworn to our destruction. He sought to save... He sent me away that day at Fort George. He feared for my safety. I should have stayed. He said there was no danger. He was wrong. I will kill you, Connor. This I swear. Not here, though. Not today. No. First... First, I'll destroy all you hold dear. I'll burn that homestead of yours to the ground and roast the seven heads of your precious founding fathers in its flames. And when I've finished with them, all the rest will burn as well. Your merry band of assassins, the human refuse that lives on your land, your village and its people, all of it, gone. You can try, Charles. But as with all your schemes, this too will end in failure. Get him on his feet. He will wait. He will watch. And then, when he's seen all his life's work brought to ruin, only then will I allow him to die.
Where is Charles Lee gone? The harbor. To catch a ferry.